Hello and welcome to this video on the new VST3 support in Banana Box 2025 for Mac. This video was taken from our long new features video that also includes lots of other exciting new features in Banana Box 2025. We'll include a link to the full video in the comments below. I'm going to continue going through this patches list in a minute, but first I want to show you another new feature and that's the new VST3 support in Banana Box 2025. This is a nice sounding electric piano, but to me it's just screaming out to add some additional effects, maybe a tremolo or a chorus. So the MIDI plugins for Sando is in the first plugin slot, and we have three other plugin slots available that we can also use. So I'll click on the second slot and add a VST3 plugin. So this is the new VST3 dialog. Before I actually pick a plugin, I'll show you some of the elements in this dialog. First of all, the options here. In this area, we can see the various locations where Band in a Box is going to look for VST3 plugins. These two locations are the most common locations for VST3 plugins to reside, and those were added by default. However, if you know that you have VST plugins in other locations, you can add other locations using this menu item. And if you've added some file paths that you don't need anymore, you can just select this to go back to the defaults. If you do add new search directories, you would want to rescan to add those to the list. If there were VST3 plugins that you thought you were supposed to have but don't appear in the list, it's possible that they failed to scan, so you could look at a list that shows you all of the ones that failed to scan. And there are other options as well for removing VST plugins if you no longer have them. The plugin list will automatically be filtered to show you the plugin types that are applicable. For MIDI tracks, the first slot will be instrument plugins, and of course we have an instrument plugin in the first slot here, the Vintage Electric Piano, but then the remaining slots will be for effects. And so this list is now only showing effects type plugins. So I'm going to add chorus. And now we have chorus on this vintage electric piano sound. I can bypass it to get the original sound. but I definitely like it better with the chorus. And I can tweak these settings as well. So back to the patches dialog, if I scroll further, we can see that the playable reel tracks and reel drums are also in this list. Like the high Q sounds, they load instances of Sforzando with specific sounds loaded. So I'll try out this Vibes playable reel track sound. Maybe I'll add one more plug into this. I'll try this trance gate. This is a cool one and is also locked into the tempo of the song. If I slow the song down, the plugin adjusts accordingly. Thank you. 